They are totally united right now in the in two goals. One is to release all the hostages, which is now the major goal. And then they are still believing in crushing Hamas. And I think the government will have full support to continue the war. I don't see Israel giving up now, uh, continuing the war. I hope it will not get back to the same intensity, because if it gets back to the same intensity, it means now destroying the south part of Gaza, where now there are already two, over two million people there. There is, Israel has no idea what will be the day after, even if they will destroy all the southern part of Gaza and trash Hamas. There is no plan. And if there is no plan, the war should stop. Emotions are very anti-Arab and we need a new leadership. I don't see anything happening with the current leadership and the current mood in Israeli public opinion, which is very extremist now and very nationalistic and very right-wing. The only hope is international intervention. And again, even this I don't see because the United States is getting into election year and I don't see Biden doing much more than he did. And I don't see hope right now. Israelis will be very happy to empty Gaza from the Palestinian people. The only problem is that this is not only not moral, it's also not legal and not practical above all. Nobody will take 2.3 million people. Nobody will let Israel to transfer 2.3 million people. Israel will not decide where the people of Gaza are going to live their lives. Israel has no right to decide so. Israel did one Nakba and it doesn't have any right for a second Nakba. Israel is doing for 55 years in the West Bank and what the army is doing is just the crimes of war on a daily basis.